E equal to 2.718, which is not equal to 1. But this is the E value is always positive. Okay, now. So generally, not only E power X can say, A power X also can say exponential function only, where A is positive and that A is not equal to 1. That is also called as the exponential function. So here, we can write as function form f of x equal to e power x. So I try to see the t material and I try to solve it. Now that one is natural logarithm function. So we call it as the ln. So you know the logarithm and natural logarithm. Logarithm means log log x. Natural logarithm means ln x. Ln x and e power x both are inverse to each other. Why, uh, why do you say these two are inverse to each other means uh, if you take this product of these two, the getting value is equal to 1 like that. So therefore, we can say log e power x equal to x, e power log x equal to x. These two are the very important formulas. We use uh, many of the problems, uh, only these two formulas. So log e power x equal to x or e power log x equal to x. And one more is 3 into log e equal to 1. That is the third one is, you can say log e equal to 1. So first one is log e power x equal to x e power log x equal to x and third one is log e equal to 1. Why? Because log e power 1, no? log e power x equal to x, e power log x equal to x, based on the first one, can say third one. Log e power x equal to x means log e power 1 also equal to 1 only. I think I'll have been clear now. Now, this is, let us see some examples. Very simple. Log one based on log e power x equal to x, you can say log e square equal to 2 log e power minus 1 equal to minus 1, log e root e, root e nothing but e power 1 by 2, which is equal to 1 by 2. So, like this, we can say not only this one, for example, log e power minus 2, log e power minus 3, log e power 100, log e power 1000, whatever it may be, whatever the power it is, the answer is the power value. Therefore, for example, log e power 100 equal to what do you say? 100 only. So, similarly, log e power sin x is also equal to what do you call sin x. So, in this one, log e power sin x equal to sin x into log e. But we know the log e value equal to 1. So, our answer is equal to, what do you say, sin x. Therefore, log e power m equal to m into log j. Already you know the formula in log m, sir. log e power m equal to m log a. Therefore, sin x into log e. Therefore, we can write this one, that value equal to sin x only. Are you following? Yes, sir. Very good, thank you. Uh, similarly, log, uh, you can say next formula, one more e power log x equal to x we seen. Based on the formula, I can see some more examples. Uh, e power log x equal to x. So, e power log 2 equal to what? e power log 2 equal to? 2 only. E power 3 log 2, observe carefully here. E power 3 log 2, just we have to observe the cursor moment. E power 3 log 2, that is E power 3 log 2 can be rewritten as E power log 2 cubed. 2 cubed means what? 8. That is E power log 8. E power log 8 equal to what? E power log 8 equal to 8 only. Therefore, e power log x square plus 1. e power log x square plus 1, similarly, similarly can say, e power log x equal to x form, e power log x square plus 1 is also called as what? What do you get? x square plus 1 itself only. x square plus 1. So, that are the, this are a few examples based on the e power log x equal to x. The following operations, we can see the rules of the uh, using logarithm and exponentials. So here, see, to remove the logarithm, sometimes we have to remove the logarithm. If it is logarithm, is there? If to, uh, I want to remove the exponential, we take the, remove the logarithm by taking the exponential and the logarithm forms. So for example, see, in this one log is there. Again, problem is log y equal to 3x plus 5. In this one, we take an exponential. Just observe carefully, same next one example. This is e power there. To remove exponential, we can take the natural logarithm. So try to see these two examples, compare one by one, automatically you can get the clear idea. So whenever the problem carries logarithm, 
we have to do exponent exponent on exponent on both sides the exponential on both sides if it is the problem contain exponential we take na, the logarithm on the both sides so just uh, in general if the problem contain e square for example a square to remove the square what to do take the square root to remove the square root what to do we have to take the square that means squaring on both sides or take square root on both sides like that here also if it is logarithm we have to take the exponential to remove the logarithm if it is exponential to remove exponential we take the log on both sides so now let us see the first problem contain log we need, we need to remove this log actually we need to find y value no so to find y value our aim is to remove the log therefore log y equal to 3x plus 5 exponential at both sides we get the e power log y equal to e power 3x plus 5. Therefore, y equal to e power 3x plus 5. Therefore, what do you say? To remove exponential from the equation, to take what do you do? Take the log on both sides. So, this is clear over. So, for the second purpose, we can take the, if it is exponential, we have to use the log on them. So, log e power 2x equal to 10 given there the problem. e power 2x equal to 10. Take log on both sides. Log e power 2x equal to log 10 that is 2x equal to log 10 2x equal to log 10 2x equal to log 10 that is x equal to 1 by 2 into log 10 okay now all are clear now are you clear yes sir okay thank you so next one is uh, loss of exponential function so you don't worry about this is the all basic one um, things in this module Next time, one onwards, we'll see one by one. If you get any doubt there, I'll write on paper and show it to you. No problem. So, present the you know, this one. So, in meanwhile, if you get any doubt anywhere, just you have to unmute yourself and ask me. Don't worry about that. You are always welcome to ask your doubts. Okay, na? So, any one of you, not, not only this person, you can, at the meanwhile, any one of you can unmute yourself and don't worry. So, I will be responded. So, if you ask me doubts, I will feel very happy. No problem. So, last now we see loss of exponential functions. So, these are the only ex general exponentials. For example, we know the formula for a power m into a power n equal to a power m plus n, a power m by a power n equal to a power m minus n, a power minus m equal to 1 by a power m, a power m whole power m equal to a power m into m. So, like that. Just they are going to use here e power e power a into e power b equal to e power a plus b e power a by e power b equal to e power a minus b e power minus a equal to 1 by e power a e power a whole power b equal to e power a b or e power b whole power a. So already you know the formulas. So same formulas we change into exponential formulas. So by using that we have to go do some simplification. See. E, e power x plus log 2. E power x plus log 2 is a right e power log 2. Like a power m plus n equal to a power m into a power n. A power m plus n is a a power m into a power m like so here e power x plus log 2 what do you say e power x into e power log 2 e power x into e power log 2 already we seen previous uh, formula e power log x equal to x see here look here e power log x equal to x e power log 2 equal to 2 therefore can write as the 2 into e power x therefore e power x plus log 2 equal to 2 into e power x. This is about the simplification of the value. Hello, e sir. power. Uh, Jabma. Sir, Chalamani ki class join kaal ke dhanda sir andko. Class? Class room lo ki join join aur le dhanda sir. Kaal ke dhanda ko. Ah, un sir. Jab to link kuchh nahi tha. Ha, kuchh nahi sir. Wal invite no accessibility na lo. Yeah, sir. You are removed from the, you know, sir. 
కాదు మా ఇప్పుడు మీకు లింక్ ఇచ్చింది వాళ్ళు పాత లాగి అంటే కొత్త దాంట్లో లాగింగ్ కావాలి చెప్తా సార్ ఎక్కువ కొందరు అది పాత దాంట్లో లాగింగ్ అయింది అంటే వాళ్ళు అది కాబట్టి బహుశా వాటి మూడు వస్తా ఉంటుంది కొత్త మెయిల్ ఇచ్చినప్పుడు మనకు వచ్చింది మెయిల్ ఇచ్చింది కదా చూడండి
సెకండ్ వన్ చూడండి ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఇక్కడ ఈ ఫోర్ మైనస్ లా ఎక్స్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఈ ఫోర్ మైనస్ లా ఎక్స్ ఈ పవర్ మైనస్ లా ఎక్స్ ఈ పవర్ లా ఎక్స్ సో ఆల్రెడీ నో ఈ పవర్ లా ఎక్స్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఎక్స్ ఓన్లీ దేర్ ఫోర్ దైవ్ ఈక్వల్ టు వన్ బై ఎక్స్ సో ఈ పవర్ లా ఎక్స్ కెన్ బి రైట్ యాజ్ వన్ బై ఈ పవర్ లా ఎక్స్ వైన్ ఈ పవర్ లా ఎక్స్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఎక్స్ దే ఫోర్ దైవ్ ఈక్వల్ టు వన్ బై ఎక్స్ సో సిమిలర్లీ నెక్స్ట్ ఫార్మ్ లా a power m by a power m form so e power 2x by e e power 2x by e what do you say e power 2x by e power 1 so by taking the a power m by a power m form a power m minus n that equal to e power 2x minus 1 only just only we base form class nothing to worry here and now come to the derivatives therefore so the derivative of e power x equal to generally here we get the proof also so try to uh, know the proof actually only the formula is very simple derivative of e power x equal to always e power x that's all wherever you get e power x derivative to that equal to only e power x that's enough so here y equal to f of, f of x which is equal to e power x we know that the derivative of y equal to f of x is given by so we need to find f dash of x already is, i think you know the limit concept last semester so f dash of x formula what is say limit has comes to 0 that must be f of x by h so here what is f of x value f of x value function equal to e power x therefore f of x has equal to e power x plus h therefore now we can say f dash of x equal to limit has comes to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x by h which is equal to limit has comes to 0 e power x plus h minus e power x by h that is limit has comes to 0 e power x into e power h by because a power m plus n equal to a power m into a power m formula e power x into e power x minus e power x by h what is common here e power x is common by taking e power x common e power x into e power h minus 1 by h so by taking e power x separately what do you say e power x into limit h comes to 0 e power h minus 1 by h this value equal to 1 no this order value equal to 1 therefore what do you say e power because of already know this formula therefore e power x into 1 which is equal to e power x so try to see we have to use the definition of the derivative that is f dash of x equal to limit h comes to 0 f of x plus h minus f of x by h formula in that x h is nothing but e power x h minus that value so i had to substitute the value f of x equal to e power x so by taking this one get the derivative of e power x equal to e power x only then next one say if u is a differentiable function like chain rule amma here you can use the chain rule form is u equal to e of x what do you say here d by dx of e power x for u equal to e power u into d by dx of u or d by dx of e power f of x equal to e power f of x into d by dx of f of x so let us see an example it comes clearly 